Hey guys, welcome to San Francisco. The beautiful thing about this city is that you get a big city, you get the bars, the restaurants, like whatever you want, but a couple miles away, you get all of this. Trolley car. I work as a uh, freelance content writer. Uh, which I love doing. I've always been a bit of a nomad. I'm really into beer, but I also was really, really, really into yoga. I always knew that I was Norwegian growing up, but it wasn't something that we really talked about, and it certainly wasn't something that we planned on, uh, you know, trying to go see. I'm shopping for shoes for the show, uh, but I don't know what kind of shoes I need. Uh, tennis shoes, probably, not fancy shoes. Do I need snowshoes? I don't know the rules. The other thing that made me feel like I needed to connect with my family, other than the fact that I'm getting older and I simply haven't had the opportunity, is losing my parents. This sort of thing makes you realize how, how important family is. You don't know how long you're gonna have them. I am with my family. This is my aunt, Steph, and this is my brother, Tony. This is the Norwegian side. Say hello. Hello. <laughs> hey, I don't remember like talking about being from Norway a lot. Do you feel like you knew a lot of stories and a lot more about well, your heritage I, growing up? I was very proud of being Norwegian. My grandparents were uh, members of the Sons of Norway, um, did all the Norwegian traditional things, and I was very blonde, so I looked Norwegian. Right. <laughs> <laughs> when was the last time you went to Norway? Well, I was just in Norway this past summer. And that was the first time you'd been since like 19... 1953. Oh, here they are. Here we are in Oslo, in the park in Oslo. And who, that would be your dad when he was like five and like I was nine and, and then there's Nana and Grandpa and, and my mom. So cute. I feel like a piece of me is lost after I lost my parents. So to know that I might have like so much more family that I've never even met is comforting and inspiring and scary kind of. There are a lot of pictures here of, of people in Norway, so... I can't wait to learn about my heritage, um, and I can't wait to just see where I came from. 